Pelle here and I hope you guys liked the preview of this CRT title card you guys are going to be learning today and if you guys don't know I have a website called editingvisuals.com where I have a lot of editing packs that's going to help you out in your editing. Especially for this tutorial we have CRT presets which are going to give you that really cool CRT aesthetic so feel free to check out the website. Now let's get into the tutorial. So here I'm in After Effects I have added a footage i'm not going to be using it in the beginning now but uh, i'm just going to yeah i just added a uh, footage uh, that i'm going to be using as a you know reference how it's going to look the title card in the end uh, but what we're going to be doing is basically start off by creating our text here so the this is the title here of the music video the movie whatever you guys uh, are creating but i'm going to just type crt for the yeah the sake of this tutorial just the text here increase the size a little bit Go to align and align the text. Something like this is uh, good for me. So after that, you're satisfied with your title, basically. We're going to be adding some effects to this uh, yeah, text here. And the first effect is going to be flicker. And for this flicker here, I'm going to be increasing the amplitude to uh, 0.5. And then the random color amplitude to 0.2. So it's going to be flickering and giving some random colors, basically, to uh, the text. Which I think looks pretty good. After that... The, I would say key effect to make a CRT effect is the grid effect. So I'm going to add that, uh, change the size from to width and height sliders. I'm going to set the width here to 3 and the height I'm going to set it to 10. And then blending mode is going to be hard light and then the color here is going to be black. Now we guys will have to adjust the borders here. I'm going to go with 2, so it's going to create yeah this kind of look here which I think looks yeah, very accurate to the CRT look. I'm going to be adding Distort RGB and it's going to give this look here. And I'm going to adjust that by dragging the amount down to minus 0.02. So it's going to look something like this here, giving this uh, cool like RGB waves here. And now we're going to be keyframing the rotated warp direction. So I'm going to keyframe it at zero in the beginning here, then go to one second go 360 degrees here so now we get this cool movement here to the CRT text you guys, you guys can open the text settings here effects distort RGB and then you can hold alt press the clock here and I'm going to get the express section up here and I'm going to type loop out so it's going to continue looping uh, this CRT effect here and it's going to look something like this CRT text now which is yeah, pretty clean in my opinion and now I'm going to be adding deep glow after that and you guys don't need deep glow you guys can use the normal glows in After Effects you just have to make different layers uh, I have a tutorial on it it's called the best way to make glow in After Effects if you guys are wondering how to make a yeah, deep glow kind of look without the actual plugin so be sure to check that out if you guys are curious now for the deep glow settings, I'm going to set the radius to 500 and then the exposure to 0.7. Now I'm uh, yeah done with the normal CRT text here. I'm yeah pretty satisfied with the look. I'm now going to make the extra like small text uh, to this title card. So I'm going to press Ctrl D on this uh, text here. I'm going to type directed dot and then my name here, just as an example. I'm going to drag the size down. Don't forget to check the uh, unmold setting, by the way. You guys can see the other text. Yeah, I'm going to drag it down, something like that. Then I want to yeah, align it with this kind of side here. So I'm going to set it a little bit inwards like that. Nice, now the text is aligned, I would say, with the C here, the side. Looks uh, clean, in my opinion. After that, Control D, go to position settings, drag it to the side here. And I'm going to type edited by Pelle Sjöberg. Maybe a weird name for Americans or yeah, non-Scandinavian people watching now. <laughs> yeah, align to something like this. And for the t final touch, control D, drag it up here. Featuring, I'm going to type Don. Oliver because yeah that's the music video I have here in the background and I'm going to match text under so it's like the same distance from the yeah big title text to the small text under here I would say this looks very clean it's aligned all the way up here like that and the same here 
with the T there. Um, yeah, I'm pretty satisfied with this title card here. And if you guys like the CRT aesthetic, I have made a CRT preset pack, which yeah, I'm going to be showing to you guys real fast. So if you make an adjustment layer, you guys can go to effects, animation, animation presets, user presets, CRT presets. I have some bonus presets here. We have the matrix CRT. It's going to look something like this. Pretty, pretty cool. You guys can, if you think it's too dark, add the curves, increase the brightness, and it's going to look something like this. Very, very clean CRT effect you guys can use for your projects. You can also use the retro CRT effect. It's going to look something like this here. Pretty, pretty cool CRT effect as well. And of course, you guys can adjust with the curve settings if it's too dark or bright. And we have a Sapphire CRT. Looks very clean in my opinion, and these are just free effects from yeah the CRT preset pack. Yeah, it's basically a very <laughs> very big time save to yeah invest in these and get over 20 pre-made CRT presets basically. And yeah, and if you guys are interested in this CRT preset pack, don't forget to use the discount code Pelle while checking out. That way you guys will save five dollars. And yeah, I've actually made a ultimate CRT effect two weeks ago, and I'm going to be adding that to the. Uh, yeah, background layer because I think it's yeah more fitting if the background actually have a CRT effect as well. Tutorial presets, ultimate CRT effect, make drag this above. Might be a little bit too bright to be honest. You guys can drag down the yeah color to a dark gray here. Okay, so now my recording you know crashed again for some reason. I don't know why, but yeah, basically what I did was yeah adding the ultimate CRT effect on top of the whole composition and then. The text is going to be too bright when you add that, so you have to change the color of your text to a more gray, not as bright color, and it's going to look pretty good in my opinion. And just by doing that last thing, you guys will get the finishing result I showed you guys in the preview. Sorry for the crash, guys. I don't, <laughs> I don't know why this is crashing all the time, but uh, gotta fix that. Other than that, thank you guys for watching the tutorial. If you guys like this tutorial, don't forget to like and subscribe and share this tutorial. Don't forget to check out our website, editingvisuals.com, where we have a pretty good editing packs, you know, that's going to help you out with your editing. Also, don't forget to check out our socials, join our Discord server, and I will see you guys soon. Take care, and have a nice day.